All right, so Kodo is best beast. That's a great card. Two for one-er. Uh, Soulfire for the double backstab. Certainly better than the others. Choice of Gnomish Inventor, or really that's the only choice. It's the best card. Ooh, it's a little risky to play uh, Sense Demons with nothing, but I don't like the Gurubashi Berserker. The Corruption is a joke card. I can count on getting imps, right? There's an imp. Always pick imps. Uh, Shadow Bolt, good removal. Beats those two. Uh, Voodoo Doctor. Yes, that's the best card. It happens sometimes. Um, Direwolf Alpha. It's better than the other two. Demon Fire. Removal slash imp buffer. Uh, these two cards. I mean, this card is actually surprisingly good in the Warlock deck. The Mountain Giant. Um, if you were to play the Mountain Giant, it would probably be in a Warlock deck. That said, though, I'll still pick Blood Knight as the more consistently good card, and sometimes that card is disgusting. Dark Scale Healer versus Wolf Rider. That's actually a bit of a close call. Let's use the Dark Scale. Three mana deal, three damage. Of course, quite unexceptional. A Flame Imp. Awesome. Needs more Imps. Uh, these, this card is bad. This card is meh. Two mana, two, three. Not very exciting. Ooh, Flame Imp. Um, more sense demons? No. Mad Bomber synergizes badly with Blood Imp. Might still be the right choice. Eh, Razor Fin Hunter's alright. It's better with the Blood Imps. Hey, a Soul Fire, yeah! Uh, Boar is terrible. Owl is not very good, but Summoning Portal is worse, I would say. I think Succubus is a terrible card. And I'll choose Bluegill Warrior because of that. The Voidwalker sort of dilutes the sense demons. Also, I think it's standalone quite bad, although turn one Voidwalker, turn two Demon Fire is awesome. But I'd rather have more reliability, and also the Gnomish Inventor is really strong. Uh, choice of three mana, three threes, or big game Hunter. I'll choose big game. I think I've got a lot of spells. No, I have four. I guess I've got five spells. I don't like the other two at all. And some of the spells are free, so easier. Uh, I'll choose Novice over Fen Creeper. Brewmaster over those, I think. Yeah, you have like no fours. This is a strong four. And just pure stat value. Crusader beats uh, the other two. Drain Life doesn't do enough. Alright, another Kodo. Unless I want to pick the two. One, two, three. I only have three two drops. I probably should pick Pyromancer. I have no two mana, three twos. Alright, fine. Ah, the Kodo is so much better. I can play Demon Fire on two, Bluegill Warrior on two, Direwolf Alpha is playable on two, Croc on two, Novice Engineer I suppose is playable on two. And I've got five more picks. Kodo is too. Nah, double Kodo is a little too much. Whatever. Warlock decks tend to be some of the best for questing adventures. This one is not that great, but it's still pretty good. Alright, got the second Blood Imp. Uh, Siphon Soul is hard kill, or Imp Master just as a great minion. I have a lot of threes already. I suppose I could use one hard kill in the deck. It's also the only card that's six plus, so that's fun. Dark Iron Dwarf, very strong minion. Definitely need more on the four splat. Argent Commander, auto pick. Over everything? Maybe. Cool. Okay, let's roll. All right, this is a uh, this is actually as weak. Like the two is technically fine, but I'm pretty sure I have way better. I could keep the two. Hmm. I'm gonna play the Voodoo Doctor since it dies to. Well met. Uh, reinforce. I greet you. I'm not gonna play the Bluegill Warrior since it dies to reinforce. So let's start. Reporting for duty. The Scarlet Crusader isn't so good because it gets pinged off by the one one. Ah, eh, that's still fine. For the 
I was almost thinking of greeting it up to such an extent of not playing that there and just tapping again. Nah. Sort of justice. Scary play. Come the gnomes. Silver Moon shall not Wow. Blood Knight value the dream. Glory to the Sindora. And I think I'll play the novice before soul firing. Unless I want to tap soul fire. Nah. I hope you like my invention. Eh, tap soul fire would actually have been completely legit. Oh, my no mission venture. Just think, you'll have contributed Joy towards the Trump gets a haircut fund. Alright, Dark Iron Dwarf, the one two send into Not the cult. Or rather. Well, either way this pings oh, off the shield. If you're sure. That voodoo doctor value. Someone call for the doctor. Hey, give me a minute. Thank you, uh, large turd, for your five dollar donation and your comment of "You are the best." No, large turd. We must I must assure you that you are the best. For Lorthamar. You call that a weapon? You call that a weapon? Hey, give me a minute. Reporting for duty. Maybe. Probably. Oh, no. Hey, give me a minute. <laughs> it's the reduced to one guy. Oh, Well played. Done. Two, six, eight, ten. I have to kill next turn, so I might as well save this. This doesn't save much from consecration, so no. Justice. Two, four, eight, ten. Get behind me. Practicing my careless. Wow. Oh. oh, interesting. That doesn't work. Huh. Sorry if that seemed like slow rolling. I was practicing my uh, attack style. I'm tempted to mulligan everything that's not the flame imp, also. It's a little greedy considering I have already a baseline to start with. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. Paid off. The pleasure is mine.
I think it's really important to think long and hard about the mulligan choice. Since it is me? the thing that starts off the entire game and is probably the biggest effect you can have on the way things go. Uh, thank you, Large Turd, for uh, stepping up the nation. Very generous to eleven dollars. Wait, oh my gosh! Wow, the value—it's incredible. This guy, it's insane. That is actually insane. I'm still the best. Well, you are still the best for generous contributions. Oh crap. I actually didn't want to draw the Blood Imp because now Sense Demons can only find one Blood Imp. That's rough life. Don't mess with Tusker. Do I have to? For So the reason why I'm against a mohawk haircut is because that would require styling. Worthless imp, here I come. Normally playing the Argent Commander would be the best play here first, but this guarantees the win. Still. Because you don't discard that, you still have the Dark Iron Door. Either way, really. Well played. Ooh. Let the hunt Almost. begin. Your soul shall be mine! All right. Got turn one flame imp, turn two bluegill, turn three questing. It's pretty good. If I miss turn three questing, I have the sense demons. Why would I keep sense? I guess for flexibility. The dream would be to. Oh, actually, it would be nice to turn three sense demons. To set up the questing um, in, in play. Ooh, I do have the questing coin in play already. That should be pretty good. Questing coin imp plus two plus three, so it's out of panther range. Great. Give me a quest. I placed that really badly for explosive shot. Thankfully, you cannot cast it this turn. What do I think about Succubus if it was 4 4? I'd probably think it'd be quite good then. Wow, he chose not to kill the questing. Mistakes were made. Quest me, um, accepted. Now he's gonna come to me. My guy's too big a threat. Quest accepted. There's that explosive shot. It's a shame it actually mattered in my positioning. Alright, I'm hoping to draw the two flame imps. But it's possible to get flame imp blood imp. Which is also fine. Yeah, large turd, you are 
<laughs> you are rocking it today. Attend me. Ready, sir. Get in there, Emp. usually keep. It's got a turn one, a turn two, a turn three, and a turn four. And yet, yet I feel like it can be so much more. Milligan one card. Hmm. And got worse, but that happens sometimes. I still stand by this. Hmm, do I want to just soul fire that right now? Playing the river croc is not very good. It basically grew out of control. So many but it's possible that no spells will be played on it. I'll be fine. something. I could shadow bolt that, but it's not a big enough threat. He's probably been waiting for something to frost bolt. This is a target. Hmm. It's a pretty important thing to siphon the soul of, I'd say. But there's no reason to right now? There is. It'll kill my stuff otherwise. Alright, turn six. He's got four cards and a slightly, very slightly better board. Uh, I have seven cards, so somehow I've gained a three card advantage over him. Probably because of what, tapping twice and going second. Something like that. And no mission inventor. I am uh, actually going to be taking serious advice if there's any pro hair guys later when it winds down, maybe. Your magic shall not save you.
Ooh, welcome to Valley Town, large turd. I should only play three cards. Hmm. Does that mean I tap? I don't really want to. I guess I play novice, even though it's not very good. Ah, now I'll play all of it. Thank you, uh, Irish Wristwatch, for your $2 donation. Leaving the message very entertaining and educational. Thank you. Grumble, grumble. Hmm. I hope you like my invention. I'll put it on your tab. <sighs> I hope you like my invention. Job's done. The reason I did it that last turn is because I figured I would still have a lot of card advantage afterwards. Someday I'll be just like you. got me to a uh, fireball range if he decides to all out attack me which would probably be the move to do since there's mm. no real great trades he can engineer right now I'm, ready. I'm certainly I'm forced to trade ready. with him uh, four six into the four 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 five into the three two. 3-3 three, three into the 2-1, and then finally 3-1 into the something. Where shall I strike? Give me a quest. I've got the beast in my sights. I'm favored to win, but... It's entirely possible for him to. Wow. Of course. That's pretty good. No, not that great. Why did I even say that was good? I don't know. Uh, playing with Flame Imp means I drop down to 4, which is in Frostbolt's range. But if I play both of these, that's 4, 4, 8, um, 4, 10. 10, so he's mm. at 19. And then uh, next turn I can hit him for 10, 13, 14. I think I should just play the Worthless Imp. Unfortunately, that's not possible right now. Quest accepted. Come on, worthless simp. You're needed. <laughs> Whoops. Mind if I roll knee? My shield for Argus. Okay, so that's nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So I'll win by playing everything in my hand. Send 
Dorai. That was close. Where shall I go? Worthless edge. You're out of here. Sort of. You asked for it. Your soul shall be mine. Mulligan all three. This hand is okay. It's um actually got turn two engineer turn three dark iron dwarf and that's good because uh that's plus one card advantage and the turn three four four um the slight problem with the plan is if there's a three two on turn two but in that case i play the blue guild warrior all right i'll keep this hand all right minus that card Actually, the big problem with this hand is uh, if I face a 2-3. Then I guess Novice Engineer plus Bugil Warrior takes it down, which is sort of a 1 for 1, though it's my 4 mana against his 2 mana. What do I think of High Control slash Freeze Mage decks in general? Um, they seem fairly lucky, if, uh, just reading Sharp's question. They seem fairly lucky if you ask me, yet they seem to play a lot in tournaments. I think um, they can be strong against aggro. It does depend pretty much entirely on your draw, which uh, you could say about every deck, but yeah, it's a fine deck. I think it might have a superior matchup against aggro. Someday I'll be just like you. Hard to say for sure. Alright, good old questing coin imp play for a 4-5 adventure. Yeah, build your own yeti, yo. Yeah? Give me a quest. <laughs> Pretty good. I think I can keep that wolf up. I hope you like my invention. This turn, that's gonna be able to get the novice. Still good value for him there. All right, end of turn six. He'll have probably three cards in hand to my six cards in hand. He'll probably play one card, maybe two. Kodo. Should have attacked one first to increase the chances of killing the 2 3. Ah, 4 5, that's out of range of uh, Argent. It's also out of range of Dark Iron Dwarf. We could siphon its soul. The other option is Flame Imp Dark Iron Dwarf. I like that option more. Since there might be something scarier to get later. Since the two one doesn't really exist. Hmm. That ended pretty good for me. Uh, since demons before tap, I think. No, tap first because I might draw something that. <sighs> crumble, crumble. Hello, worthless imp. The ideal play is to play Flame Imp and Blood Imp, but if I'm forced to play a Worthless Imp, I suppose I can do that. No, I actually don't want to play the Worthless Imp since it might get uh, thrown away by Soulfire. I guess I would just play nothing if I can't play Flame Imp. Oh, 
false statement. I am. I've got the beast in my sight. Let's see. Do I have to? Or not at all. Pass me that arc light spanner. Ready to ride. Where shall I strike? Pass me that arc light spanner. No. Worthless imp can take it out. Well, then again, this saves the dark scale healer. Hmm. No, that's fine. I probably should have also played Voodoo. Eh. Semi playing around Flame Strike, semi playing around Wolf Rider, semi playing around this. A mix of all of it. Finally, be very certain that he does not have flame strength. Hey, give me a minute. To Northrend, victory! I mean, they're all fairly close, as you can see from stats, yo. Uh, this hand, I would normally keep it and be pretty happy with it, but I'm a warlock and I got one drops. Makes me greed. I'll keep just demon fire. Eh, maybe bluegill also. Nah, demon fire and bluegill are the same card. Point out dark scale healer, I guess. My eyes are open. If I sense demons, I'll get a three three. That's fine. Maybe a three four. Hmm. You like my invention.
Ugh, I don't want to use my Arjun Commander on this, so I won't. Should have tapped first. Um, that does change my decision. <laughs> Eight mana, I could die with Alpha Argent Commander of the Yeti. Hmm. Or spell damage. Siphoning its soul is probably good enough. Yes, it is. Soul firing a uh, gorilla, even though the soul fire also kills the totem. Still not worth. Great. The perfect solution to your 6 5. no matter which one I play. I'll keep the Voodoo Doctor as a quote-unquote spell, I guess. Attack with the. I need to panic. Some win, it seems. Probably has some sort of buff in his hand. Hmm. 
I will fight with honor. Your soul shall be mine. Hmm. Enough's engineer would be pretty good if he uh started with the hero ability. So if he mulligans all three, I'll keep novice engineer. Okay. Otherwise, I would have risked also getting rid of uh, novice. Reporting for duty. If I draw an imp, considering I've got four imps in the deck, chances aren't that bad. Let the pain speak to me. Ooh. Looks like value acolyte, but it isn't. Could have even waited for Stampeding Kodo. Now he would have already drawn a card off of it, in that case. It's a true silver champion. If I play the questing and the flame imp, it'll be a 3-3. If I play the gnomish, it's a guaranteed 2-4, which the questing, uh, which the true silver will absolutely kill. I think questing has a good chance of being awesome later, though. So I'll, uh, not let his true silver kill the questing. Seems like next turn I could play questing, voodoo, flame imp, soul fire. Reporting for duty. Or I could stampeding soul fire. Hmm. The problem with going the questing voodoo flame imp soul fire route is he'll have a 1-1 one, one that can kill my 2-1. The benefit of doing that is I get a 5-5, five, five, which is out of reach of most cards. Other than Blessing of Kings, which would be so trading Blessing of Kings for questing, which is also good. And the Voodoo survives in that case. Give me a quest. I got the best deals anywhere. Hmm, this card would move Flame Imp out of Consecrate range, but not much else other than that. But also allow my uh, probably worse, it moves this guy out of four range. Let me think. Follow the rules. Do you call that a wet? Alright, demon firing that becomes a 5-5. Five, five. I soul fire, I blue gill. Hopefully I draw a card that doesn't cost too much. That's beautiful. Oh, crap. Deal four damage. Whenever you cast a spell, draw a card. Deal four damage, discard a random card. Oh my gosh, what order does that go in? I'm pretty sure it goes in my favor. I'm not 100%. Please work. No. I also soul fired the wrong one. Well. Oh. Uh oh. Just swung that into 
his favor. Six eight five. Okay. Reporting for duty. For the crusade. Worthless owl. Stand ready. Why couldn't you make it one bigger? Join. I've got the beast in my stage. Not on my watch. Reporting for duty. If I don't do Join this, then the four flies. Ah, oh, light's just as faded. Yeah, yeah, you gotta be kidding me! Well, well played. I drew eight the more cards than he did. It wasn't enough. Well played. You win. Well played. I mean, you did go like a five for one with Consecrate, so. Oh, the brutality. The light shall bring victory. Your soul shall be mine. If I don't draw two, it's going to be a tough decision between Blood Imp and Tap. Probably Tap. I feel icky. No, now it's going to be Blood Imp. Now it's still going to be Tap. Now it's going to be Blood Imp. Oh, now it's going to be tap. What? Hmm, maybe I demon fire. This would kill the leper gnome, though it puts uh, blood and bat risk. Yeah. He presumably did coin powered shield to uh, avoid the um, somewhat common one mana warlock spell. All right, so mind spike. That's too good. Glory to the Sindori. Do I have to join or die? I was tempted not to trade and just go for the face there, but no. This play is uh, more vulnerable to shadow or death. But if he doesn't have it, then a six-eight is very difficult to deal with on turn four. 
In a world where a 4-5 Yeti is extremely strong, the 6-8 is king. Oh, now I can dark scale healer and heal this back to full so it's out of mind spike range. Oh, excellent. Life's pretty good here. Tough life. The problem with this uh, shadow form thing and the mm. thought steal is he essentially skipped turn threes and four. In some amount of pain, some large amount. Um, so much pain. Is someone injured? Well played. To Northrend! Victory! Pretty tough. That hand was too slow. You asked for it. More souls! Are there any VODs of me and Crypt casting last night? Yeah, it's probably on the 2P website. Hmm. I'll keep River Croc if I don't like it. This hand got a lot better. He plays a 2-3 uh, with the coin right now. And if he plays a 3-2 with the coin, then I'll just go for his head. Huh, that. Is not good for him. Oh my goodness. Oh, the humanity. Wanna blow something up? Well, good bomber on his side. Congrats. I think Soulfire would be a poor card in we must cleanse the sun many well. other classes. However, since it's from the Warlock, it turns out to actually be fairly good. It's interesting. That's because it's a Warlock card, that's good. That's sort of the uh, potential pitfall of not trading there. It could get Shattered Sun cleric and that was one of the worst case scenarios. I didn't really think about it since I thought my Flame Imps were the ones that were under danger. Shattered Sun cleric ended up being able to uh, two for one me as a result. Which is awfully annoying. Oh, if you're sure. Put it on your Alright. End of turn 5, we have the same board, it's most likely going to be empty. He's got 6 cards, so plus 1 card advantage, and he gets to play first. Though my hand is quite good. It's got a lot of powerful 4s to 6s. Someday I'll be just like you! For the crusade! Come on... Blood Knight. Oh. Hmm. Like my invention. Dark Iron Dwarf on this guy uh, invites this to kill this, I this wonder. to kill this, and trade Fire Blast. The good news is that leaves it. Yeah. If only I had a spell, like a Wild Pyromancer. Soulfire is slightly not that good right now because of the chance of discarding a really good card. It's still worth. I get the best deal. You like to play with me. 
Still fine. Oh, this is value. Oh, nope. Ah, he had the coin this entire time. Alright, good use of the coin. In both constructed, but especially in arena, it feels horrible to have your Argent Commander get Argent Commandered. Just sucks to get Argent Commander, period. This card is so good. Don't mess with Tusker. Pass me that park light spanner. Hmm. This game has been so bloody that I've forgotten he's a mage. So I have to watch out for a flame strike. I could so kill this and then play the Voodoo Doctor. That presents two targets that are outside of range. Hello. And uh, with four mana left over, I could play the Scarlet Crusader to really Victoria. overload his uh, ability to call for the use his ping on this turn. Good news is he does not have flame strike. All right. If this gets copied, that would be quite good for me. It's not copy. Not that, so it has something Join to do with spells. Or, or ice blocks. Hey, give me a minute. So I've got three, five, eight, eleven damage lined up on him. Clearly doesn't have flame strike. For I hope you like my invention. Yeah. I've got a huge guy. Four, six, eight. Nope. Nope. Hey, give me a minute. Don't imp will save. This guy from Fluff, and that guy from... Yep. Pay attention, class! And also, uh, thank you, large turd, medium turd, and small turd, for your... <laughs> donations. I'm definitely feeling the, uh... Turd love here. All right, so two, four, five, six. I have lethal. If that is not, so basically, if this fails, I win. going uh I just thought of this an idea so I'll give you a hint if you're paying attention now I predict that despite there being uh quite a lot of people in chat right now that when I roll there are going to be fewer than easily fewer than a hundred people who are going to be in the drawing 
That's my hint. It'll be open to everyone. Can't think of something that could go too horribly wrong by not trading here. For the crusade! I took a moment to think about it. We must cleanse the Sunwell. Do you need a blessing? Oh, that could go wrong. Oh, it didn't. Shame I can't play that first. Alright. Hmm. What card do I not want him to copy? Would I rather him have a Blood Imp or a Flame Imp? A Flame Imp. No, a Blood Imp. This card is not very good right now. It's too late. Do I have to? Do I have to? We'll make it fair. Pass me that arc light spanner. Thank you, uh, Earl, for the two dollar donation and also uh, the extra key. And also, thank you, you I'll need put it on your for the five dollar donation. And Mind if I roll knee? No, I the extra no. key. I'll make sure to find good places for them. I've got the beast in my sights. Quest accepted. Your magic shall not save you. This trick seems to come up more often than not. For some reason, it just keeps showing up for me. Dark Iron Dwarf. Big Game Hunter. Dark Iron Dwarf. Big Game Hunter. Finally, I caught one use of it. He's thinking about whether or not he wants to trade his blood up. I think it would be a good idea. What to do? What to do? <laughs> Quest accepted! Commit against Flame Strike. Uh, this is more than enough, I'd say. If he has it, he'll play it here. And also, uh, thank you, Zero Hour, for your $5 donation. He asked the question What's your favorite class? In Constructed, it's uh, Shaman right now. Because I think they're the strongest, and I think they're pretty cool. In Arena, I'm okay with any of them, that's why I randomize it. No real preference. I've got a huge gun! 
If I played him, it wouldn't matter. Turns out it wouldn't. Soul Fire, Gadgets and Auctioneer interaction being against your favor is rather annoying. Aha! Dark Scale Healer. Do I have any more demons in here? Maybe one more. No, I've used them all. It's gonna be two worthless imps. Is... He'll probably be forced to trade this into this, so I can soul fire next turn anyways. Close ain't good enough. Glory to the Sindora. <laughs> Let the pain speak to me. He draws into something, I guess. As long as this uh, blood imp survives, I have it. Maybe I should have attacked him for one with the blood imp. Nah. To Northrend. Alright, surprise GG. To Northrend! Victory! Go him! Void terror. It really wants to eat things. Alright, well, 